All engine running. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. I have uh, this thing called a tuning fork. Okay, kind of looks like a little fork that you would eat food with. And so tuning forks are typically used for like musical instruments to help tune them, um, like a piano or something like that. And so it has this little kind of rubber mallet with it. Now, whenever I um, hit it, it is actually going to vibrate. And you might be able to see um, it kind of vibrating just a little bit, and it's gonna produce um, a type of tone. Okay, so let me hit it a few times and let's see if we can hear it and maybe even see it. Ready? Here we go. Ooh, let me bring it close up to the microphone. Ooh. Okay, so it is making a pitch. Okay, I'm gonna hit it again. Let's see if we can really see those vibrations. I can kind of see it with my eyes a little bit, so you gotta really focus on it. It is vibrating very, very, very quickly. And once it does that, it is moving the air particles around it and kind of traveling through just the, the air itself and eventually gets into my eardrum so I can hear it, okay? Now, to be able to see that a little bit better, what we're gonna do, I'm actually going to take a cup and I'm gonna put some water in it. Okay, so here is my cup filled with water. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set it down on the table so we can get a, I gotta use both hands for this. And you notice there's water inside of my cup, pretty full to the top. And I'm going to take the tuning fork and I'm going to hit it a few times and then I'm actually gonna stick it down inside of the water. And what do you think is going to happen? Well, let's find out, ready? Ooh, well that was cool, I'm gonna do it again. A few hits, straight into the water. Ooh, wow. So the vibrations from my tuning fork are actually moving into the water, making the water spray out all over my table. So it really proves that the tuning fork is vibrating and moving, allowing the water inside of my cup to also move, which is really, really cool. For another demonstration related to sound, I'm actually gonna use uh, this ping pong ball that's attached to the string. I have it hanging on side of this uh, little ring stand just so it's um, ele uh, elevated here so you can see it. And what I'm gonna do is again, I'm gonna hit the tuning fork and I'm just gonna kinda lightly hold it up next to the ping pong ball. I'm not gonna hit it, I'm just gonna lightly press it up to it so they touch each other and let's see what happens to the ping pong ball. Ready, here we go. Wow, whoa, that was really cool. Let's do it again. Make sure it's not moving. All right. Whoa, I almost made a basket on the top. So that is so cool. So because of the vibrations that are inside that are happening with the tuning fork as I hit it, it is now causing those sound waves is what we would call to move into the ping pong ball. Um, and now it's making the ping pong ball move. Okay, all I'm doing is using the power of sound to make the ping pong ball move.